everybody hi my name is lunia and i make a lot of videos so if you're not a subscriber you already know what to do <laughs> but before i start you guys i wanted to show y'all a little a very little mini haul that i have puppies in the background and they're in my room right now and they don't really like to be alone or they're gonna cry all night so i put the cage in my room so if you guys hear them they're just playing in the background but yes so i can't wait for them to go to sleep i want to show you guys a little mini haul i went to the hair store earlier today and i got some very cute hair accessories and some hair scarf for other style videos i have planned for you guys so I like to go to my favorite local beauty supply stores. I know I get that comment a lot when I do style videos. People ask me where I get my accessories or my hair wraps at my hair store. I try to find cute things. If your hair store don't have cute things, then you can go on Amazon and literally type cute hair scarves or, you know. So, in total, I spent $30, so it wasn't bad at all, so... I'm gonna start with this very, very satin wrap. I said very satin wrap, <laughs> very, very, very gorgeous satin wrap. I love the print, that's what really got me cause you know, I'm all about the bright, nice print, you know? And I love how they have in the back. All right, let me show you guys. They show different ways you can wrap your hair with it, which is so cute, right? For people who, you know, are like new to this. I think that's very cool. So the next one I got by, it's not the same brand. This one is a different brand. So yeah, so this one said it's edge scarf premium silky satin the ultimate edge scarf so i guess it's not an all over scarf it's like a around the perimeter type of scarf and it says it's perfect for keeping your edges smooth okay i needed that okay neat and in place especially recommended for lace front protection uh, especially for lace on protection but it's gonna be for this protection but i love the print again you see this is this is what i just like bright in your face you know that's my style and the third scarf i only got three this is the same brand as the last one oh my god this is just so cute y'all just look at this look at this i don't know if i should open it up and show y'all no i'm not gonna open it till i do the videos with them because i plan on doing um that spot on locks videos you know the next thing i got just a simple just a gold thread because i want to put some in my i like how it looks when you have a bun you know it also keeps the locks together when you just wrap it around it. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys. I'll be using these a lot. So. Next, I got these cute shells. Close up. They're like rings shells. I like those cause I don't have to stick the shells in my locks since my locks have gotten thicker. I can't really do that anymore. So the rings are gonna come in handy. I could just stick it inside instead of putting my locks inside of the shell, you know? I got these other cute little rings with like, what are those? Balls with sparkles? <laughs> Balls with sparkles, yeah, I guess. But they're so cute. Like, I thought they were so cute. My hair still have the cutest accessories. I'm sorry if my hair stores don't, but. And then these are just regular gold cuffs. Yeah, with like woods at the ends. Would be little woods. I'm gonna put them in my locks when I dye 
my locks pretty soon. Okay, these are my favorite. Oh my God, they're like clips. Now you could clip it in your hair. Y'all see, come with little clips. You clip it in and it just hangs with like, y'all see? Cause I was thinking about making my own, but my hair still came through. So this one I got has shells. This one, let me show y'all. Let me really show y'all the design. It comes with, with shells and the little strings hanging. It's gonna look so, so cute when I style my locks, when I get my retwist and my new color. Oh, y'all not ready. Okay, and this one has just, it has beads and feathers. And at the end is the strings. I'm put one on one side, one on the other side. Those are so freaking cute. Like, it's so cute. I remember making these the little strings in back in middle school in arts and crafts. Wow, those were the days, but we literally used to make these. That's why I was gonna make my own and put it in my hair, but look at God. Okay, the last but not least, some more strings that I got. I'm just gonna pick like, probably like two, three locks and like wrap it around. Wrap first side one more, wrap red, and then cut it, then put the next color, then put the next color. So I'm just gonna stack it up on the dreadlock. So yeah, that's gonna be real cute with my color. Also, I can't wait for you guys to see what I'm what I have planned for my hair this summer, sis. Okay, almost three years, guys. September is around the corner. Oh my gosh, and my locks look touching my shoulders. So yes, by September, I should be a little right here. I hope, cause my locks grow every month. It gets longer and longer, so. Yeah, that is all guys. That is all I have for y'all. So the mini haul is over. I got some pretty cute things that was worth it all together. It was three dollars 29 and some change and not bad at all so let's jump right into it start by showing you guys the products i use i'm going to be using tonight today right now it's tonight but so i always use a moisturizer when i style my hair which is a must it makes your hair looks nice and moist and not and not crisp and tangled you know I go into my root spray spray, you know, I comb with my fingers and do all that, I separate, you know, you know, so less breakage. And then I go and oil, so, you know, I get the shiny, pretty texture. That's how I get it. And I also have another moisturizer. It's a leave-in conditioner. I have used this a lot. And this one is Cream of Nature, Argan argan oil from morocco leave-in conditioner yeah so basically yeah and for my edges i always use the yellow gorilla snot let's get into this let's reveal these edges let's see let's see if i really lay these babies to the gods or did i fail you guys <laughs> okay y'all Ooh, that bit kind of stuck because I had split that bit down and I had blow dry that bit. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh oh. I just. Hi, look, y'all. Okay. Alright, it's given. It's given, it's given. Mm hmm. Period, sis. <laughs> see i still have a little bit of color residue on my locks that's because i i'm not sure if i want to go back with the remover or if i just want to put the red like this because since i'm gonna have color over i don't really you don't really need to be off 100 percent because the red is really gonna hide this so it's like i feel like less chemical the better even though it says no bleach it still has 
some form of chemical that's changing your hair color, you know? So I'm just like, oh, I don't think I wanna go over. I did it. First, I'm gonna go in with the Argan Oil by Cream of Nature Leave-In Conditioner. It smells so good. I love this conditioner so much. And I love how it has oil in it already, so. It's like half oil, half conditioner, and I love that. Spray, get my hair dipped. And I'm gonna spray my locks too because I like when they are moisturized. hair you can already see my hair is already my roots is already looking more nicer and detangled and not matted so your style can look better it's not that you need a retwist you just need to moisturize your hair sis Sometimes I feel like some styles look better with the with the little roots like this, to be honest. Then I'm gonna go in with the other moisturizer, which is optional, whatever you like to moisturize with. This one, I'm gonna just focus it on my roots. Avoid spraying my edges, y'all, just because, you know, once you get them babies wet, it's over. <laughs> so, does y'all see this? Y'all see this moisturized hair? It is giving, what is it giving me? It's giving me super baby soft. Run my finger through it, no tangle. Oh, look at this smooth no tangle and I, you know i have a lot of new growth my hair would have got stuck in there already before just straight okay let's go with the oil my hair get really soft when it's moisturized this is this is no special oil i just have a extra version olive oil and this organic to y'all organic that bottle was expensive i tell you because <laughs> somebody told me that um coconut oil um gives um because she actually do locks and sh she do hair and she told me that coconut oil leaves from what she's seen it leaves the locks like what did she say like either they leave it dry or build up she says something coconut oil due to the locks that she noticed from people who use it on their locks because she saw i posted myself oiling my locks on my story with coconut oil so i took her advice you know I'm like, thanks, sis. You do hair, sis. I believe you. She's licensed and worked in the salon, so I, I don't know it all. I'm gonna learn from people that y'all yeah, know I go to school for that right now. So like, I'm gonna start working in the salon doing locks. I already have found my salon home. I'm excited. Oh my god, I'm so excited. And. I'm gonna start next month because she, she said it's really up to me whenever I feel like I'm really comfortable, that like I'm ready to transfer my clients, which I told her give me by the by the beginning of July. When some do some clients for the price is going up, but I'm also gonna gain new clients that wants to pay for the great job that I 
provide the great service and style I provide. So I'm very really good at what I do. So I'm so excited for that. So once the girl, once well, not the girl, once the woman, she's a grown woman. She told me that I still have my jar of coconut oil and I stopped using it because I'm like, hmm, maybe she right. I used to use it when I was loose natural, but maybe it's different with logs. So I just switched to olive oil. But I still use, still use um castor oil and all that good stuff on my scalp all the time, constantly. Like, I don't know who oils their hair more than me. Because literally every night I'm in my scalp. That is dedication. <laughs> okay, they feel nice and moisturized. Look at how flat it's laying. You see? This is why I'm like, I don't really need a retwist. My hair looks very, very cute like this. A retwist look nice and everything, but I really like my roots not showing. You know, I prefer it, but and but a retwist is good for you know growing your lock. You need a retwist. And I'm not free for me, but I can't wait to come by my lock. You, I made my mind. It's going to happen. Your girl is gonna come by her locks. And I just want to thank y'all so much for making it to the end of the video. Thank you for watching. And thank you for being my subbies. I hope you guys got some tips and moisturize your locks. Take care of your scalp. And you guys have a great night or day. And don't forget to love yourself. Mwah.